Hi, this is Eva. Today I'm showing you how to make a water bottle counter. As you know, to stay hydrated, you should drink eight eight ounce bottles of water today. And to keep track of those, I'm making a water bottle counter with eight beads on it so that you can count all of the eight bottles of water that you drink. This is the finished product. On it, it has a lanyard hook so that you can hook it to your belt loop, uh, a cord, eight beads, and the finishing so that the beads don't fall off. The cord I bought at Joann's or Michael's and it's called parachute cord number 325. That's parachute cord 325. I'm going to need eight and a half inches. And to make it, I bend it in half and I use a piece of wire. I made a threader out of 20 gauge wire that I also bought at either Joann's or Michael's. And I hook it over the edge the middle part, I measure my cord in half and put the threader halfway. Then this will bead, thread each of the beads. Might be a little bit of a struggle here to get it over, especially the first one, but it goes on and you take it almost to the end and then do the other seven beads Here's bead number two until you have eight beads like this. After you put on the beads, make sure your ends are even. You may have to finagle a little bit to get, get it even. And then at the round, the closed end, you put on your lanyard hook. Then to make by the way, the beads are called pony beads, and they fit perfect over the two strands of the parachute cord. Then to seal the ends, I purchased what is called hink shrink tubing at Lowe's or Home Depot. This specific one came in an eight foot length but I cut it into half inch pieces. They thread, the two strands thread into the tubing. Not always easy. You want to pull the tubing to where it's almost to the end and it sh heat shrinks. So you need a little bit of flame. I'm using just a fire, a candle starter. And you can see it just shrink. Be careful, it's hot. But that's it. All done.